Hey guys, welcome to this new expedition video. Uh, Laura and I, we are in Australia right now, the very first time in this beautiful country. And uh, we're out in Perth, looking around for some animals before the rest of the team arrives. They're gonna arrive later today and tomorrow. And then we're gonna start one of the most epic journeys, I hope, that we've ever done in our lives. So we're ready for it, and I hope you guys are as well. The main target for this trip was the infamous thorny devil, arguably the most bizarre lizard on the planet. On our route we were planning on visiting the best areas for this species to give us the best shot possible at spotting it. But of course we weren't going to neglect everything else, we were hoping to see as many species of animals as possible along the way. So we uh, finally left Perth and uh, we're on our way to the Kalbari, the first real stop of the uh, expedition. We already got some cool tiger snakes this morning and uh, some two guides, uh, shingle bag skinks. It has been amazing. Now we're in one of the most incredible landscapes I've ever been in. These are the pinnacles. Look at that. Beautiful, beautiful landscape. Uh, limestone erosions. Uh, wow, it looks amazing. There should be thorny devils here as well, but uh, yeah, it's gonna get uh, hard tracking one of those down on uh, the entire trip anyway. But uh, wow, look at this. This is absolutely amazing. Gorgeous. So we arrived in the, the Kalbari yesterday. We saw a beautiful Stimson's python on the road. And now we're here in the Kalbari National Park looking for more target species. So uh, we're gonna look around for maybe a Parenti, one of the largest monitors in the world and the largest monitor in Australia. And uh, hopefully we get a few snakes along the way as well. So there's Parenti tracks all over here. As you can see, but no parentheses. Let's see, maybe I can follow these tracks a little bit, but I'm not sure where they're gonna end up. So the tracks let me straight to these bushes here. But yeah, it's impossible to track any further than this. I think you can see a slight hint of where it must have gone, but then it's bush. Endless bush, so I think there's no hope for this guy, but uh, we'll keep looking and uh, hopefully we'll get uh, another one by surprise, who knows. Thank you. 
Our journey through Western Australia took us from Perth all the way up to Port Hedland and back, an incredible route along Australia's most majestic coastline. So we're in the Francois Perron National Park. Uh, we've been uh, looking around here for a few days already. And um, well, we're here for the main target uh, of this expedition, which is the thorny devil, uh, Molochoridus. Beautiful, beautiful lizard, uh, but very rare, very rare, very hard to get. Uh, we're looking around uh, these red uh, uh, dune and, 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 and bush systems, but we have not uh, been lucky so far. We've been uh, going out on the best times of the day, like right now, it's actually prime time for them. We've been seeing some tracks, but it's hard to see if they're all old or new um, but uh, yeah we'll keep going it's not our last chance for this species uh, but uh, yeah it's mainly the main target for for every single person on this trip so um, let's continue and let's hope that we uh, get lucky and um, and see one on this trip but uh, yeah this is our last day in the park um, fingers crossed we'll see So we're in Garagini National Park right now, swimming in one of the gorges. It's really gorgeous. <laughs> but um, we're actually looking for small uh, rock monitors uh, on, the, on the rocks here. So you have Oranus hamersleyensis that lives in these gorges. We haven't seen one yet, but um, let's hope we find one. And let's hope we get some footage of them, um, especially if we're in water. It's not gonna be that easy, but uh, we'll see.
So we've been uh, traveling for the last few days and um, coming up from uh, coming down from Port Hedland all the way to Exmouth. We've seen loads of cool stuff along the way and a lot of our target species have been ticked off. But we're still on the lookout for a thorny devil. Um, it's not the best season for a thorny devils. Uh, you know, it gets quite hot quite quickly. Uh, and also, you know, everything just seems to be um, you know, not in our favor. Like right now, you're probably here, it's quite windy out uh, in this uh, habitat. Uh, and I think this is just what is, uh, you know, making it almost impossible for us to find. But we'll have one more shot uh, tomorrow and the day after, like two more shots. Uh, and let's hope we can find one. But um, I'm losing hope on the Thorny Devils, to be honest. But, you know, we'll see. We're going down uh, back to uh, Coral Bay tomorrow. Uh, and then it's off to Geraldton, and then the trip is over, then we're off to Perth, and it's gonna be done then, so um, wish us luck, let's hope we get one, but uh, I think it's gonna be for the next run. Thorny Devils, mythical creatures. <sighs> of the most beautiful spots in Australia and it's uh, world renowned for uh, diving and snorkeling so that's what we're going to do uh, today. After a short visit to Rodnest Island, we had to go home. 
We've had an amazing time in Western Australia and saw more than we had hoped. But unfortunately, our mission to see a thorny devil had failed. But all the more reason to go back. If you want to join our next adventure to Australia, keep an eye out on our website, www.herb.be. If you like this video, there's more coming up. Please like, comment and subscribe. Thank you for watching and we'll catch you on the next one.